was trying to make mini form, but it was a little too complicated. I only got like a couple pieces. And um, so I'm like, how would I get, how about I do the collage and I cut out like an animal or something and add to that. And I came in with this crazy thing, uh, Frogzilla. This is a general 4-H club. The way that this club works is the kids get to choose at the beginning of the 4-H year. I let them choose the project area that they would like to focus on for the year. Um, and this club has chosen a variety of things over the years, but this year they chose art. I saw a flower in the back of a magazine, so I did like a flower one. Like, mine is pretty much destruction and its consequences. Destruction and consequences, wow. <laughs> older kids pick the theme and this time two of the boys picked um, collage uh, so they learned a little bit about collage on their own and then was able to show the other kids what to do. Today I helped lead a meeting about making collages. It was pretty fun. And it sort of is almost like a dream because it's sort of like space and sort of weird because there's like a banjo and random banjo so Okay, this is basically what goes on inside my mind because my subconscious is really, really whacked up. <laughs> I don't know. Forks? I do like forks, actually. There's a peanut here. And a peanut. Peanut. And a peanut. what you came up with. I knew you would do a good job, but I really, I wasn't sure that you would be quite this creative. I'm very impressed by what you've done. And I encourage you to make some more collages at home. And if you come up with one that you think is really a good one, you are more than welcome to put it in the fair next fall as an art project to show what we did this year for our project. So, great job.